All right, guys, welcome to another episode of Asheville Auto Repairs. Well, guys and girls, welcome to another episode of Asheville Auto Repairs. Can you dig it? All right, guys, here's part six, 2004 Chevy Monte Carlo. I just came back from the shop again. The guy was not there. Now I'm not sure if they lied to me because I was, somebody was there and I asked to speak to William and they said he wasn't here. But I'm gonna still go back. But here's an update, guys. We're gonna be pulling off the heads on this car. Um, there ain't no messing around. The customer wants to go with that and give a shout out to Olivia. Olivia is the owner of this car. She started watching these videos and she's contemplating on getting a, getting an attorney also. And uh, Olivia, if you're watching, there are a few people who came together and they, they, they want to buy the parts from you, buy the parts for you. But uh, we told them, no, you got that under control. Our focus, we need to stop these shops from doing that. Now, having said that, it is difficult dealing with stupid people. <laughs> I mean, it is real, it is real difficult. Guys, check this out. This, is, this, this thing is becoming, uh, Ernesto, good. Ernesto said this is better than days of our, days of our lives. <laughs> check this out. Uh, we, we, <laughs> we contacted Olivia and we told her, you know, what the parts she needed, and we gave her the part number, the part number, to go to AutoZone and uh, get the head. AutoZone is giving her a hard time. It's like it's like people want to fight this girl. All the every step of the way of this, it's like nothing can go right for her. What the heck is going on? Why are people so stupid? All right, guys, check this out. We're sip, we're, we're looking at the cylinder head, and you saw the cylinder head also. There's two types of cylinder head there's one with eight millimeter bolts, and there's one with 10 millimeter bolts. Now, the one that they drilled out and messed that thing up that was a 10 millimeter, the rest of them is eight millimeter. That's it, that's all, but no. They want to go tell her you need the block number. The the we gave her we gave her the casting number on the head. They still giving her a hard time with this. Could you believe this, guys? So she had emailed us. Olivia has emailed us and asked us, "Can we make the call?" We're not dealing with stupidity. So what we're gonna do here? When we get heads, we deal with Cylinder Heads International, and the Cylinder Heads at AutoZone. Is two same man, get the guys check this out now. Same part number and everything. Cylinder Head International so AutoZone is two hundred and nine dollars. Cylinder Head International now AutoZone is two hundred nine dollars or whatever something like that. And then on top of that, it's, I think it's a seventy five dollar core on top of that. Cylinder Head International is one hundred and fifty dollars. All this the most, most um it's a for this cylinder head it's one hundred and fifty dollars with a twenty dollar core. And they don't charge you that twenty dollar call in the beginning. I think they give you time to send it back. Then they're gonna send it. So what we're gonna do. Somebody's emailing her right at this moment, right at this moment, of doing this video, and she's giving her the contact information to Cylinder Head International. Now, be before we did that, Sylvia called up. Oh, this is then coming a story, man. I should write a book on this one. <laughs> Sylvia called up Cylinder Head International. Told him the vehicle, 2004 Chevy Monte Carlo, 3.4. We need a cylinder head. How much is it? $150, $20 core. If you don't return the other one. All right. Is there any kind of diff any kind of information you need? Yes. We need to know whether there's eight millimeter bolts or 10 millimeter bolts. And if it's 10 millimeter bolts, we need to know does the car have a smog on it, some kind of smog thing on it. We're not worried about that because it's not 10 millimeter. It's eight millimeter. Same part number. Their part number is the same as AutoZone. It's 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 getting pathetic to deal with some of these these shops, man. And I mean, not the shop. Well, the shops too. The auto auto. That's why we deal with Fisher Auto Parts because these. I don't know. get that. But anyway, so we're going getting down into it. We're gonna be doing the heads on it. Uh, <coughs> just one head, but I am doing both head gaskets because they ain't no use in us down this part. And we don't, we don't come and find out. And just like I said, Olivia, check this out. If you checked out the last uh, part five, you see we went down there and we saw somebody down there. And he told us this guy's going to court for a lot of people. But I still want to talk to him to see if he can re reimburse some kind of way. At first, now, I was thinking, all right, at least pay for the head and pay for the head gasket. But now, we're we getting that taken care of. 
Put something in. 100 bucks. 200 bucks. Something. I mean, dang it. Be decent about it. <laughs> right? <laughs> but, um, that's where we're at. Just like I said, this video series is not only to keep you guys informed about what's going on. It's to keep Olivia updated about what's going on. And, um, you know, just in case this thing does hit court or whatever, this is video proof. There's no question about it. Not that even Olivia, personally, I think if we take him to court, we're just going to get a judgment. But his shot, we're like, it's about to close down already. That's a bummy shot. <laughs> but anyway, uh, Ernesto, we appreciate it. Paul, Paul, contact. I got to call Paul right now as soon as I get off this video. Uh, he called us about an hour ago and he was ready to buy all the parts for it and i gotta call him back and i um let him know. I re guys we really appreciate it and i know a little and and i'm gonna have a, on the i think you know actually on part seven i'm gonna have i'm gonna introduce you guys to olivia you know she wants to appreciate all your support on this any kind of questions questions comments or even suggestions be sure to email me Tim at astralautorepairs.com or you can put them in the comment section below. We're going to get this done. We're going to get this done. Alright guys, girls, this is Timmy from Astral Auto Repairs. If we can't repair it, nobody can. Take it easy. Yeah. Olivia, you better, yeah, yeah, you heard me. You better get ready. Part 6. Or was it part? I don't know. What the heck we on, man? Who's this? Part six we're doing right now? Dang it. <laughs> Take it easy.